What's up guys, this is Gus and you're watching Unplugged. Today we're going to be putting up my custom Logitech G203 versus the Glorious Model O. Are the Model O stock features better than my modded Logitech 203 mouse? I think you guys will be quite surprised. With that being said, let's begin. First, let's introduce my custom mouse very quickly. This is my modded G203. I added a paracord, some leisure skin, and hyperglides to give me the best experience when I game. To see an in more depth review on my G203 and its features, there is going to be a video down in the description below just for that. Now for the Model O. The Model O, as many of you know, comes with very stock features that are supposed to be just as good as some of the mods I added to my mouse. So let's compare the first feature, the cord. According to Glorious, the cord is an ultra flexible and super lightweight cable that gives your mouse an almost wireless feel. It's supposed to be very flexible like a paracord and it definitely is better than the stock cord most mice come with, like this Rival 310, but it's not as good as the paracord on my G203. The paracord on my G203 is thinner, thus more flexible, whereas the cable on the Model O is thicker, impacting its flexibility. As for the wireless feel, well the paracord of my mouse definitely gave you a better wireless feeling out of the two due to its flexibility. The next feature we're going to talk about is the feet. Just how good are the feet on the Model O? Compared to the stock feet on my 310, they are definitely smoother. Putting it up against my modded mouse however, well, the feet feel great. I had a hard time trying to figure out which feet were better out of the two as they both felt great. However, there is a slighter smoother feel on my custom G203. So yet again, my mouse had the better feature. As for the grips, I'm not going to make a comparison as the Model O does not have any rubberized sides and to be honest, it really doesn't need any as the size and shape was perfect enough to fit great in my hand. So the conclusion, the features on my mouse are better, but not by much. Surprised? Don't be. The Model O is a great mouse for anyone looking for great features on a mouse without having to mess with it. If you want a mouse that feels good, looks good, and performs good, the Model O is a great choice. I think that every gamer, whether they are competitive or not, should really consider getting one. I had to modify my mouse, something a lot of people aren't too comfortable doing, to make it slightly better than the Model O. The stock features on the Model O are better than the stock features that come with any other mouse that is currently on the market today, my G203 included. Thank you guys for watching, Gus signing off.